The world of compact cameras is about to get more exciting. DJI, the company famous for making amazing drones and cameras, might be planning something big with their next Osmo Pocket Camera. If you've been following DJI's journey, you'll know that their Osmo Pocket series has been a game-changer for people who love making videos. The latest one, the Osmo Pocket 3 which came out in October 2023, was already pretty impressive with its rotating screen and bigger sensor. But what's next? Let's dive into what we might see in the upcoming Osmo Pocket 4. The Osmo Pocket 3 camera currently has a 1-inch sensor and takes photos with a 9.4 megapixel resolution, which means each photo has 9.4 million tiny dots that make up the image. This is good, and it can take nice photos and videos. But some people want even better quality, especially for photos that are sharper and clearer. So, the Pocket 4 might come with an upgraded sensor that could capture even more detail. Imagine the camera is getting a new set of eyes that can see things even more clearly, especially in low light. With a higher megapixel count possibly 12 megapixels or more Pocket 4 could capture photos and videos that have more detail and look sharper. This upgrade would make everything in the photos look more realistic and easier to see clearly, even in darker places. Right now, the Osmo Pocket 3 can take videos at 120 frames per second in 4K quality. That's already pretty amazing it means you can make super smooth slow motion videos. But the Pocket 4 might go even faster, maybe up to 4K 240 frames per second, just like some of its competitors. This means even more amazing slow motion shots. The video quality might also get better with improved color depth and HDR capabilities, making your videos look more like what you see with your own eyes. The Pocket 3 is pretty good at keeping things in focus with its Active Track 6.0 technology, but sometimes it gets confused, especially in tricky lighting. The Pocket 4 might get even better at this, maybe with something called phase detection or eye tracking. This means it could be better at following moving objects or people's faces. Imagine never having to worry about your videos being blurry or out of focus. While the Pocket 3's 2-inch rotating screen is nice, the Pocket 4 might get an even bigger and brighter screen, possibly 2.5 inches. This would make it easier to see what you're filming, especially when you're outside in bright sunlight. The touch controls might also become more responsive and intuitive, making it easier for everyone to use, whether you're a beginner or a pro. DJI might also give us more accessories to use with the Pocket 4. Right now, you can get things like wide-angle lenses and wireless microphones in the Creator Combo. But imagine having more options maybe a waterproof case for filming in the rain, or special filters to make your videos look even cooler. The audio system might also get better, with improved wind noise reduction and clearer sound recording. There might even be new mounting options to attach the camera to different things, making it more versatile for all kinds of filming situations. One area where we might see big improvements is battery life. The current Pocket 3 can film for about 166 minutes on a single charge. The Pocket 4 might push this even further, maybe getting close to 200 minutes. The charging might also get faster imagine being able to charge your camera from empty to full in just 20 minutes. The Osmo Pocket 3 is already a fantastic little camera. It has a 1-inch sensor, can shoot 4K video at 120fps, and has a nice 2-inch rotating screen. It weighs about 179 grams and is perfect for carrying around. The Pocket 4 might keep all these good things but make them even better. The stabilization might be improved even further, making your videos look super smooth even when you're running or walking quickly. The DJI Action 5 Pro is like the Pocket 3's tough cousin. 
It's waterproof up to 20 meters without a case which is deeper than most swimming pools. It also has two screens instead of one, and can handle more extreme situations. It also has great features like Rocksteady 3.0 stabilization and Horizon Steady. While the Pocket 4 probably won't be as tough as the Action 5 Pro, it might borrow some of its cool features, like the advanced stabilization technology and improved low-light performance. Now, here comes the tricky part the price. The Osmo Pocket 3 costs $539 for the basic version and $689 if you want extra accessories called the Creator Combo. The Pocket 4 might be a bit more expensive, possibly around $699 for the basic version and $799 for the Creator Combo. That's because it will probably have better technology inside. While this might seem like a lot of money, remember that you're getting a really powerful camera that can do many things. You might be wondering if you should wait for the Pocket 4 or get the Pocket 3 now. Well, that depends on what you need. If you want a great camera right now and don't mind not having the very latest features, the Pocket 3 is an excellent choice. But if you're not in a hurry and want to see what new amazing features DJI comes up with, maybe waiting for the Pocket 4 is better. Remember, technology keeps getting better, so the wait might be worth it. Looking at how DJI usually releases their cameras, we can make a good guess about when the Osmo Pocket 4 might arrive. The first Osmo Pocket came out in November 2018, then the Pocket 2 in October 2020, and the Pocket 3 in October 2023. See the pattern? There's usually about three years between each new version. So, we might see the Osmo Pocket 4 around late 2026 or early 2027. That seems like a long wait, but it gives DJI plenty of time to make something special. The company likes to take its time to make sure each new version is significantly better than the last one. The DJI Osmo Pocket 4 sounds like it's going to be an exciting camera when it finally arrives. With possibly better picture quality, faster video, smarter focus, and a nicer screen, it could be worth waiting for if you're not in a rush. But remember, these are just educated guesses based on what we know about DJI and their previous cameras. The actual Pocket 4 might be even cooler than what we're imagining. The most important thing is to think about what you want to use the camera for. Whether you choose to wait for the Pocket 4, get the current Pocket 3, or go with one of the alternatives, you're sure to have fun making videos and taking pictures. After all, the best camera is the one that helps you capture your special moments in the way you want. That all for today thanks for watching.